So I got this 2009 uh, BMW 528 uh, XI came in. Oil service will not reset. Oil level will not show. So these are the faults that I had. Ignore the alternator missing fault because it matches the oil conditioning sensor missing fault. Uh, started my diagnosis, I unplugged it just to see how that VSD circuit would respond and plugged it back in. So uh, that alternator is good. What I did, figure out, let me, let me um, scope that VSD circuit. Pulled out to my old uh, workbook from class when I was with BMW. BSD, there's an idea of what that pattern should look like, the voltages, all that good stuff. Uh, so there's a little information there for you there. I did not set my scope to five volts, just set it to 20. But take a look at that pattern right there. That's a good pattern. I do not have a short uh, to positive, short to ground. That's a good signal right there. So I'm not worried about a short, but yet, that fault is current. So what I did is you go into a test plan and there's my possible faults right there. So what I started with, go to this diagram, I'm gonna zoom in. Uh, I'm gonna work forward on this one. So there's my oil condition sensor. And that's gonna be uh, fuse number three. I get this camera to zoom correctly. Fuse number three, and that is up front. So I can I can click on that as well. And there it's showing me. It's gonna be a 20 amp fuse. So I brought my test light over and both sides of that fuse, if I get a good poke. That fuse is good. So my power supply is good. So now what I gotta check, let me move this bad boy over. What I need to now check, now mind you, this came from another shop and I know the other shop, they actually told me, hey, take it over uh, to Ryan, Euroworks, let him look at it. But they put an oil level sensor on there. So, so here I am now, my fuse is good. And mind you, that fuse powers several components. You know, so, but mind you, I don't have any other faults. So I believe I'm, I'm concentrating on just this specific component and wiring. So again, the scope pattern is good. There's my faults. Um, it is a current fault. So let me, let me show you what I found. Go up in the air here. Should be good enough. Okay. So you can see there's the new sensor. I would have never used that piece of junk, but that's me. But whenever I see this stuff brittle and chewed up, it's always suspect. But look at this. I'm gonna pull it out of the little tab there. Look at this. The BSD wires broke as is the ground. Now, how they didn't see that, man, I, I really don't know. I think Stevie Wonder might have caught that one. But anyway, there's the issue. These, these down here, these two, two of those wires. So I'm gonna I'll splice those wires back together. I'll get it back down the road. So that's the way it goes, folks, sometimes. Had it not been that obvious, maybe this was closed up. Um, I would have come down here and I would have checked my voltage supply, my ground and such. Um, not seeing this, I likely would have just sold him the harness and uh, then tore the harness apart and found the defect and you know, now I know. But uh, anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna fix those wires and uh, get this guy down the road.